Materialism and imperio criticism Russian materialism i imperio criticism materialism i imperio criticism is a philosophical work by Vladimir Lenin published in 1909 It was an obligatory subject of study in all institutions of higher education in the Soviet Union as a seminal work of dialectical materialism a part of the curriculum called Marxist Leninist philosophy Lenin argued that human perceptions correctly and accurately reflect the objective external world. Lenin formulates the fundamental philosophical contradiction between idealism and materialism as follows. Materialism is the recognition of objects in themselves or objects outside the mind, the ideas and sensations are copies or images of these objects. The opposite doctrine idealism says, the objects do not exist, outside the mind, they are connections of sensations. <laughs> Background The book, whose full title is Materialism and Imperial Criticism. Critical Comments on a Reactionary Philosophy, was written by Lenin from February through October 1908 while he was exiled in Geneva and London and was published in Moscow in May 1909 by Z. Vano Publishers. The original manuscript and preparatory materials have been lost. Most of the book was written when Lenin was in Geneva, apart from the one month spent in London, where he visited the library of the British Museum to access modern philosophical and natural science material. The index lists in excess of 200 sources for the book. In December 1908, Lenin moved from Geneva to Paris, where he worked until April 1909 on correcting the proofs. Some passages were edited to avoid Tsarist censorship. It was published in Imperial Russia with great difficulty. Lenin insisted on the rapid distribution of the book and stressed that, not only literary but also serious political obligations, were involved in its publication. The book was written as a reaction and criticism to the three-volume work Imperiumonism by Alexander Bogdanov, his political opponent within the party. In June 1909, Bogdanov was defeated at a Bolshevik mini-conference in Paris and expelled from the Central Committee, but he still retained a relevant role in the party's left wing. He participated in the Russian Revolution and after 1917, he was appointed director of the Socialist Academy of Social Sciences. Materialism and Imperio Criticism was republished in Russian in 1920 with an introduction attacking Bogdanov by Vladimir Nevsky. It subsequently appeared in over 20 languages and acquired canonical status in Marxist-Leninist philosophy. Chapter Summary In Chapter 1, The Epistemology of Empiricriticism and Dialectical Materialism I, Lenin then discusses the «solipsism» of Mach and Avenarius. In Chapter 2, The Epistemology of Empiricriticism and Dialectical Materialism II, Lenin, Cherno and Basarov confront the views of Ludwig Feuerbach, Joseph Dietzgen and Friedrich Engels and comment on the criterion of practice in epistemology. In Chapter 3, The Epistemology of Empiricriticism and Dialectical Materialism III, Lenin seeks to define matter and experience and addresses the questions of causality and necessity in nature as well as freedom and necessity and the principle of the economy of thought. In Chapter 4, The Philosophical Idealists as Collaborators and Successors of Imperial Criticism, Lenin deals with left and right Kant criticism, with the philosophy of immanence, Bogdanov's Imperi Monism, and the critique of Hermann von Helmholtz on the theory of symbols. In Chapter 5, The Latest Revolution in Science and Philosophical Idealism, Lenin deals with the thesis that the crisis of physics has disappeared matter. In this context he speaks of a physical idealism, and notes on p. 260, for the only property of matter to whose acknowledgement philosophical materialism is bound is the property of being objective reality, outside of our consciousness. In Chapter 6, Empiricriticism and Historical Materialism, Lenin discusses authors such as Bogdanov, Suvorov, Ernst Haeckel and Ernst Mach. In an addition to Chapter 4, Lenin addresses the question. From what side did N. G. Chernyshevsky criticize Kantianism? Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Philosophers and scientists cited. 
Lenin cites a broad range of philosophers. Topic: <laughs> Immanentist. Richard Avenarius. Ernst Mach. Richard von Schubert Soldern. Topic: <laughs> Russian Machists. Yakov Berman. OSIP Helfond Sergei Suvorov Pavel Yushkovich Topic See also Anti-During Imperial Criticism Vladimir Lenin Bibliography Topic Notes Topic Further reading Robert V. Daniels, A Documentary History of Communism in Russia, From Lenin to Gorbachev, 1993, ISBN 0 87451 616 1. External links Materialism and Imperial Criticism by Vladimir Lenin at the Marxists' Internet Archive